Hey guys, Eli Copperman here. Today I want to give a shout out to an independent filmmaker and book author, John Hume. Born in New Jersey himself, he rose up as a writer and a filmmaker, and is probably most well known for writing the book series The Seams with his partner Michael Wexler. And he's also well known for making his own documentary based off his own life called An Unknown Soldier, where he discovered more and more about his father who died in the Vietnam War. And another documentary he made was called Blood, Sweat, and Tears, A Basketball Exorcism, which talked about him and his life growing up in New Jersey, he and his friend's dedication to basketball, and the conflicts and topics of African Americans in New Brunswick. And on October 22nd of this year, he screened the documentary at the Highland Park High School Auditorium and received huge praise from his friends, loved ones, colleagues, and just pretty much everyone else there. But alongside making that documentary for personal reasons, there was another reason he made that, as he has a backstory of a film that he conceived but ended up never being finished. His own independent horror project. A film that kind of, right as I was getting ready to start shooting it, lost its financing and kind of collapsed. And that was sort of my worst professional experience that I've ever had. And really sort of asked myself, what, what, what am I going to do now? And it was a really dark time. And there was a tremendous amount of people in this room now uh, who helped me get through that time, who I couldn't have gotten through that time without you. But that's where you guys come in. As of now, he has recruited several kids from Highland Park, New Jersey, my hometown, to put together a documentary about the lives of African Americans in that said town. It is a small effort, but we've really been trying our absolute damnedest to really get this documentary off the ground to really showcase the life and prosperity and development of what their lives were like and catch interest of people to know what were their lives like, what did they do, who were these people, and why did they do the things that they did. However, as big of an effort as this is, we're not the only ones who have been willing to do this, as John himself is trying to get more and more filmmakers to continue the project. You know, we're, we're going to be working on this all for the rest of the year, but we're looking to recruit new filmmakers and new crew members starting in January for the next term. So if you know any, you know, 13, 14, 15 year old kid or even a senior who wants to, to be a part of this, you know, make, have them come up to me or just let me know, okay? It would be fantastic if you could pitch in so you can help make this documentary and so you can learn more about these people and the life of Highland Park before then. It really means a lot to him as someone who grew up in New Jersey. And me being a native from there, I understand that and I would love to know more about the history of this town as well. The more interested you are, the more of a gift this will be to you in history and filmmaking. So all I'm asking is that you give the guy the recognition he deserves. He's a very talented, sweet, and passionate guy who really cares about the heart of filmmaking, screenwriting, and his own life alongside prosperity. So all I'm asking is that you help this guy out and you can join in helping him make his passion projects. And even you can learn a thing or two about filmmaking. See you later.